And I'm back! After a quick trip to the refrigerator. Back here with Persona 5 Royal, part 7. Last time, we made pretty much zero progress in getting into Kamashita's castle to steal his treasure. But, we had we recruited on to Kamiki. After she was captured by Kamashita, we saved her. And now, she's she joins the party. So, what do we do now? Well, we gotta do what we can, and prepare to eventually steal Kamashita's heart. Anyway, let's just go to bed for right now because, oh right, Mona's living with us. <laughs> oh well, let's just go to bed. Well then. Oh, it's gonna be a busy day. Keep it together, alright? <laughs> I feel a strange weight pressing down on my body. Is there just a common sheet of threat weighing on me? No, it's your cat. Oh. It may be crowded, but it looks like you can still grab a seat if you're lucky. Hmm. While we're riding the train, we do have some downtime. I wonder if we can put it to good use. Oh, we will. I'm gonna put at least one much better use than I did in my last few play sh play views of Persona 5 where you can throw a social stance out the window. What's wrong? You don't look so good. I haven't been feeling well lately. My head's all foggy, and I have no energy. I've tried every drug at the pharmacy, but nothing works. Well, that's not good. Is this the onset of a psychotic breakdown? What should I do? Am I going to die? Calm down, calm down. Let's go to the clinic, come on. I'm sure the doctor can prescribe something that'll fix you right up. I see. Doctors have the best medicine, huh? Hey, wasn't that one customer back at LeBlanc a doctor? She was wearing punk clothes, remember? No! <laughs> That's not what's important here. Though she did have an interesting fashion sense. It might be nice to have some strong medicine to use in a palace. Morning! Yo, morning, Shadow. What are you doing here? Let's head to school together. I mean, it's right there, but whatever. <laughs> nice. <laughs> hey, we're meeting about the hideout after school, right? Don't text right now. We're in class. Whoa! You mean you're actually listening to all this crap? <laughs> Yeah, but none of it is really sticking today. I know, right? Anyways, hideout after school? Where exactly is this hideout? School roof. Wait, we can still go up there? Yeah, I'll let you in. Well, I'll be waiting. Just come on up once school's over. Eh, I'll consider it. <laughs> I ain't taking no for an answer. <laughs> you better come. Hey, are you listening? Uh-oh. Pay attention! Is that how you listen when, s when someone's talking to you? I feel a murderous intent. Come on, Dodger! Ow! Right in the forehead. <laughs> Ooh, that looked like it hurt. <laughs> he hit him right in the forehead. Pay attention! That's what you get for daydreaming. Kids these days have no respect for their elders. <laughs> Mo I know, Mona. Good grief. Looks like you'll need more proficiency to completely dodge that. Oh, I know. Looks like we're all here. Okay, let's get going. Let's go. Hold on, it's still too early for us to head to the palace. But why? Don't we just gotta steal that treasure thing? Don't underestimate the dangers of that place. We need to prepare. Ain't that Persona shit we got enough to deal with it? Yes or no? That's exactly what I mean when I say don't underestimate it. You'll die if you mess up in there. So again, we need to prepare before we head in. But how exactly are we supposed to do that? I'm glad you asked, Lady On. First, we'll need to find better equipment for all of you. I will never get used to that. You will never hear me say that. Ooh. You talking about weapons? Oh, I know a kick-ass place. 
In that case, you can handle that side of things. The only other thing would be stocking up on medicine. Fatigue is unavoidable in a palace. And where can we get medicine? Game's best doctor, that's where. Don't worry, I know just the place. I hope you look forward to it, Lady On. Yeah. It still sounds creepy as hell. Now then, he and I have some business in Yongen, so let's head off for today. Uh, what business? Are we going home? What business? Just come with me. I won't be able to get close enough by myself. Can I talk? Remember that customer we, you met at LeBlanc yesterday? The doctor who prescribes medication after a quick examination. She was sitting in the booth. Yeah, I remember. Actually. I, I just realized something. If she's the kind of doctor who gets sketchy rumors like that, maybe she'll help hey. us out. There's somewhere in the neighborhood, right? Take me to her. Alright. I know exactly where we're going, but for right now, let's just screw around for a bit. Mm. Looks like it's time to score it. Score it. Uh, yes, that was a cat. Cat? I am a cat person. <laughs> Can I buy a drink, though? Hey! You don't have the time to take a break and buy drinks. Hurry up and take us to the clinic. Oh! I didn't know there was a bad ass here. First, we really need to find that clinic. Oh, this is my favorite one. Hey! <laughs> Are you getting distracted by a washing machine? Hurry up and take us to the clinic. <laughs> I had to. Oh, we'll be back here in a minute in the second hand shop. That was funny, though. Oh, one more place to screw around before we actually get serious, though. No, this isn't the place we want. Orthopedic clinics don't have the type of medicine we need, remember? Well, it was a clinic, so... Here it is. This is the clinic that the chief mentioned. Now, how can we get them to give us some medicine? Eh, maybe we should leave, Mona. Hey, we can't back out now after coming all this way! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just choosing all these options just to mess with the cat before, I, the before I get serious. How do you expect normal people to understand what a palace is? Fair enough. <laughs> okay. Alright. Let's get serious. This is the clinic that the chief mentioned. Now, how can we get them to give us some medicine? You gotta make something up. Now I'm actually being serious. Well, I guess that's the only choice we have. We'll just have to go for it. Alright. Let's step inside. Step inside? It looks like an impressive elevator, though. Well, is this the reason for you? Is this your first visit? Mm. I feel like I met you someone before. Ella Blonde. Eh, whatever. What are you here for today? Uh, I kind of feel lethargic, though. That's probably the best excuse I can have, considering the whole metaverse thing. Hmm. Ah, eh, fine. Please head to the exam room. That, that is not the Takemi I know. The Takemi I know is a lot more sassy than this. In a case like yours, it's usually just due to stress. Uh, I don't like this. I don't like this change. I'm gonna prescribe you some pain relievers, okay? Takemi the character was great, but what made Takemi so funny and one of my favorite characters was her voice actress. Christian Potter did a perfect job. Actually, I still need to restock those. So let's go with sleeping pills instead. Sleep is the best medicine anyway. Which type of pill do you want? A sweet tasting one or a bitter one? A bunch of painkillers! <laughs> I come across like a drug addict, but... You tell me which one I should take. I'm not a doctor. How about a stinky one then? Yeah, the humor just does not stick. At all. <laughs> There's no such thing as a stinky pill. Just kidding, there's no such pill. Alright, why don't we stop beating around the bush? Yeah, I don't like this change. I'm gonna keep hammering this home. You're not sick at all, are you? I'm not as dumb as I look, you know. I'm guessing you're here because you heard the rumors about me, hmm? I'm not saying you look dumb, but you're probably the first doctor I've seen come to the come in the Excuse me, probably the first doctor I've seen wearing gladiator sandals and punk clothing, though. That ain't true? Who's to say? 
But as a result, all I get are patients with ulterior motives now. I guess high school kids have it tough nowadays too, huh? Yeah, we do. Well, fine. I'll prescribe you some medication. Thanks, doctor. But only medication that will help you recover your health. Yeah. Uh, crap. I can't really cheese my way out of this like I do in a new game plus on Persona 5 nowadays, where I get pretty much everything available to me. But I'm gonna start this from the beginning. This is gonna be fun. I guess it's fine. You seem pretty earnest, and you don't look like you'll be any trouble. This is my private practice. All the medicine I dispense is original. I have a license to make my own formulas. You've likely seen them being sold at various hospitals. It's your responsibility to take care of yourself. So, if that's okay with you, stop by any time. All right, thanks. I want Tristan Potter back, but other than that, thanks. I don't help. Great. It's nice that you're so quick on the uptake. Saves me the hassle. You're a pretty weird kid, you know? I wonder what you're going to use the medicine for. Uh... Well, as long as you don't cause me any trouble, it's not my problem. Fair enough. That's all I've got right now. Okay, which one? Uh... 55,000 yen, so... Um... Do you want that one? Let's see here. So I could be a little more... Uh, hold on. Thanks. Oh, did you decide? I may actually go through this palace in one there day. There you go. So oh, this. did you decide? Thanks. That should work. Here you go. Oh, did you decide? Yeah. Thanks. That should be fine. That should be enough. You want that one? There you go. And a couple of revivers. Take care. And good luck with that. <laughs> Spend half my money on meds. Oh well. What's the reason for your visit? Do you have a cold, athlete's foot, stomach ache? Whatever it is, you'll need to take a number. <laughs> we didn't have to take one. Enough of this, hmm? You're the only one who could have just developed that type of medicine. <sighs> I am afraid I have no idea what you're talking about. Don't play dumb with me. Rumor has it, it's a drug so potent it could give a person unlimited power. Really? Really? That's news to me. Developing experimental drugs, medicine, and herbal, herbal remedies violates all health regulations. Are you attempting to create a super stimulant? A drug like that will only become a social issue. <sighs> You're really persistent. You know that? I'm just a quack. The police may not be taking action, but I imagine the media will soon pick up on it. You attempt to ruin my reputation again, huh? You're a disgrace to the medical community. <sighs> mm. What's with that look? That was your mistake, was it not? I won't be responsible for your criminal actions. Dispose of that medicine immediately and resign. Then Tate Takemi will never... Also, Joker. You're doing a god-awful job at eavesdropping. If you're gonna eavesdrop, at least sit on the couch and read a magazine. Don't stand by the freaking door. Fucking idiot. <laughs> Man. They almost caught us. Suddenly they were talking about something dangerous though. Could that woman be hiding some extra strong medicine? Yeah, that could be useful. Yes. I agree. If it's that strong, it might come in handy at the palace. Alright, let's come back when that man isn't there. We shouldn't involve people who have nothing to do with this. Keep the fan of these a secret, okay? okay. That, great work. That went really well. So, you know about the store I mentioned with the model guns? It's in Shibuya. I'll go with me if you want. Cool. Sweet. Well, let's figure out where to meet. You at least know how to get to Shibuya Station, yeah? Hey, I can't make it. Can I trust you guys to check out the place for me? What, you can't come? Not tomorrow. I made plans to go see Shiho in a hospital. Ah, uh, gotcha. Don't worry, we got this. Oh. She and Shibuya Shadow. I mean, in front of the station. We might be able to get our hands on some decent stuff if this <coughs> really Excuse has me. model guns. Well, we can leave that for tomorrow. 
Let's go home. All right. Okay. Going smoothly so far. Once we prepare, let's take on that palace. That's where the real fun starts. Got it? Let's turn in for the night. Aren't you going to Shibuya tomorrow? Let's just call it a day and go to sleep. <laughs> let's turn in for the night. Hmm. Shibuya? <laughs> well, I know where it is, but I can't seem to remember whether or not I've actually been there. Okay. I mean, it was Ryuji tomorrow, so don't oversleep. He didn't tell me what time to be there. He just said, see you in Shibuya tomorrow. Sup? Looks like he made it. Job's on Central Street, so we gotta go through the crossing to get there. Crossing? That's what we call the Shibuya Crossing. It's this huge intersection with people crossing the street in every direction. Once we get past that, we'll pretty much be at Central let's Street. Alright, let's get going. Everyone, wake up! This country is twisted. Oh. While Japanese society may appear to be thriving, many young people have not been as blessed as their elders. They have no jobs, no savings, no financial security whatsoever. These young people should be tackling their futures head on, but instead, they're too busy merely trying to survive. People give speeches all the time. Plus, politics are pretty boring anyways. I've said that for the majority of my life. It wasn't until events happened in 2016 that I started paying attention to that. So the Central Street. Follow me. The shop can be pretty confusing to find sometimes. Alright. Bum bum bum. Hey! This way. Yeah. This is it. Pretty legit, huh? Place looks sketchy. Right? To be honest, it'd be a bit scary to go in alone. Anyway, let's check out what's inside. All right, cool. Let's do that. Oh yeah. Uh, before we head in, you know anything about guns and shit? Guns and shit. <laughs> Guns and shit. Okay. Nah, I guess we can just ask the guy behind the counter if we can't figure out what we want. Come on, let's do this. Guns and shit. Oh my god. Hmm. All the stuff in here looks so real. I don't know what I like best. Maybe we should ask the guy behind the counter. <sighs> you know what you want yet. You looking for recommendations? Yeah. I don't know. Just buy whatever looks interesting to you. Ugh, some customer service. Fine. What do you want? An automatic? A revolver? Uh, automatic? Dude, why are you talking about cars now? <laughs> Ryuji! <coughs> oh my god. Okay, okay. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Okay, let's keep going. Listen, this year's an enthusiast shop. My regulars will be mad if I let a casual like you hang around. I'm not a freaking casual. I bought shit from here like last week. <laughs> ah, can't remember you. Damn. You bastard. <laughs> <laughs> you bastard. And you, looking for something? Yeah. Give me a fancy model gun, please. Oh. Oh. You a collector? <laughs> You're way more interested than Blondie over there. <laughs> oh, shut it! Anyways, you should have said before you two are enthusiasts. I'm always up for helping fresh faces. Some precautions first, though. Don't go around pointing them at other people. Keep them in a bag or something if you're outside. Oh, and don't let the fuzz catch wind of you having them. I don't need them coming around here. No, don't worry. We hate the cops. How about that? Me too. How about that? Yeah. Now, if you look close, you'll be able to tell these are models. Real guns feel... different. 
Maybe someday I'll show you the real good stuff, though. If you got the guts for it, of course. But for now, you get the beginner selection. Just sit tight. I'll bring him out. <laughs> we did it, dude. We totally gotta go for some fancy shit, right? Oh, I want him to shine. <laughs> the way you said that. Oh my god. Oh, and here's the cash for mine. Pick me out something good. All right, all right. More money. Now I'm not. Let's see here. Ooh. You can purchase model guns, range weapons, melee weapons, protectors, and accessories at the airsoft shop. Melee weapons will increase the power of your normal attacks, which may be useful for those who want to defeat enemies without using skills. Range weapons increase the power of your gun. Excuse me, gun attacks. These deal more damage than melee weapons, so they may be more useful against tougher enemies. Protectors decrease the damage you take, vital to lasting longer in battle. Accessories have a variety of black effects, which provide skills and protection against status and ailments. All right, all right, which one? Hmm. That's why you're too better not use it to pull a prank. Ooh, shoulder. Okay, sounds good. Don't break it, okay? Alright, which one? I don't want that. Alright, sounds good. That's what you do better not use it to pull a prank. Alright, which one? Hmm, don't break it, okay? Yeah, we're done here. Okay. Sounds good. Yeah, we're good. Uh, come again. It's something you should know. I don't buy off any model guns from other people. Just keep that in mind. I don't want to deal with any problems buying something that's already been Later. modified. That's all I gotta say. Hmm? Oh well. Let's just go home. Boss, did you hear? Apparently that subway driver from the accident was acting really odd during his testimony hearing. You talking about that psychotic whatever thing people are going on about? Yeah, I heard it completely alters your personality. The news is saying the driver couldn't even speak when they tried asking him questions. Only an idiot would believe a preposterous story like that. Oh, and sorry, but we're closing soon. <laughs> How rude. This must be why you don't get many customers. Yikes. Your coffee's actually not half bad. The beans must be lamenting the sorry state of this store. Thanks for stopping in. Please come again. <laughs> I'm only trying to help you fix your business. Thanks for the coffee, at least. Jeez, what a pain. Oh? oh. What do you want? If you're bored, go wash some dishes or something. Uh, how's business? Doesn't concern you. It's all good as long as the shop doesn't fail. I'm not gonna go wearing a fake smile. Is that a motto of yours? <laughs> I guess that sounds like one. No, it's nothing like that. As long as I'm here, the world leaves me be. No annoyances or troublesome people to deal with. It's like my own personal hideaway. I'd be kind of screwed if I lost it. But I guess you would be too, so you better at least try and be useful around here. Anyway, I'm leaving now. Don't cause any trouble. Alright. So I went to Shishio in a hospital. How was she? Her condition is stable. They don't know when she'll regain consciousness, though. Eh, that's scary, but she'll be fine. Yeah, she'll get better. I know it. I just need to believe in her. But I'll never forgive Kamashita. He's going to pay for what he did, no matter what. We're just about ready to go to the palace. We just need to assemble some infiltration tools. Clean off that desk back there so we can use it. Okay. I'll teach you about how to make infiltration tools. You need to clean your desk first, though. Get to it. Hey. Okay, hold up. Hey. Forget that area. Hey. No, not there. The desk. Now. <laughs> I'm not letting you go to bed until you clean up that desk. Okay, fine. That desk. Hurry now and clean it up. Eh, I'm not in the mood. Don't say that. 
Come on, I'll teach you how to make infiltration tools. Come on. <laughs> All right, fine. That desk. Hurry now and clean it up. Great. Now you can make things whenever you want. I'll provide the materials this time. Try making a lock pick. With the necessary materials, you can make various infiltration tools. They will be quite useful during palace exploration. Make sure you bring them along. Making tools will cost time to pass, but it will improve your proficiency as well. Each time this ranks up, you can make one additional tool. During bad weather, your focus will allow you to make an additional tool. Check out all the shops to track down various crafting materials. Don't think too hard about it. You'll get the hang of it. Ooh, bad weather, eh? Goho M, huh? Lockpicks, calming aroma. Huh, that's new. Let's see what else is here. Everyone starts off a little clumsy. Don't be sad if it doesn't go well at first, okay? No, whatever. Great. We should be able to use this. Yeah. Ooh. I'm gonna try my hardest to get these up. We should be ready now. We're heading into the palace tomorrow. Let's get some sleep. No, we're not. We're going in Tuesday. Because I want to make a deal with my doctor first. Good morning. Come on, hurry up and get to class. Oh, look who it is. It's the number one douchebag. Good morning. Good morning to you too, asshole. That admirable behavior won't do you any good once you're expelled. Well, that wraps up the homeroom period. <clears throat> A word with you, please? Hmm? This is new. What the hell's There's going something on? I'd like to ask you. Seriously, what the hell's going on? It won't take long. I see you're already getting on top of the problem I'd mentioned this morning, Miss Kawakami. I appreciate the support. Oh no. What is going on here? Thank you again. Oh, hey. Oh, you know this guy, Yoshizawa? Yes. He lent me a helping hand earlier. Student called Yoshizawa. That rolls off the tongue. <laughs> Although, why can't you just call her Yoshizawa at this point? I recommend you steer clear of the likes of him if you have any consideration for your future. <clears throat> Do not plant seeds into this cute girl's brain. Don't plant seeds. Don't plant these bad seeds that are obviously lies. Remember the discussion we just had? There are a number of students in this school you shouldn't get involved with. This one's at the top of the list. Uh. Oh, the delinquent transfer student? God damn it! Sorry to interrupt, but I need to use the guidance office. Oh, pardon me. That's like a complete kiss ass whenever other adults are around. We should be going too. Don't want to get in the way of guiding this delinquent and all. Please excuse us. After you. After you. Ladies first. I'm gonna get straight to the point. Did something happen between you and Mr. Kamoshida? Yeah, something did. But why the hell should you care? Well, there was that little exchange just now, but that's not all. Well, yeah, he's the instigator and everything. He gave me a brief lecture this morning, and your name came up. Something about the dangers of a lack of supervision. I don't mean to pry, but just make sure you don't go causing trouble, okay? Oh, and one more thing. That girl outside the office, you didn't make a pass at her, did you? What? No! She's cute and all, but... No, no. Hell no, I didn't. 
No. No. All right. Mr. Kamoshida has a real close eye on you. Apparently, you've been getting involved with Sakamoto-kun. And? You seem acquainted with Yoshizawa-san as well. Maybe you're just naturally drawn to athletes? Sorry, bad joke. <laughs> Was that even a joke? That's all I wanted to discuss. You're free to go. Even if that was a joke, it was a really bad one. Ah, uh, man. Damn it. So I saw Kamishida at the school gate this morning. He was just standing there, looking at me with a shitty and grin on his face. Ah, uh, that's annoying. He was probably mocking you. Honestly, seeing that got me even more fired up about this. We're definitely gonna pull this off. Yeah, I'm worried about Shiho, but I want to concentrate on our operation, too. And I won't let myself get exhausted like last time. Board meetings May 2nd, right? We just gotta take care of them before then. I'm ready for this. Same goes for me. Me too! I'll do my best. No going in without me, okay? Yeah, you better let us know if you're going to the palace. Oh, I will. We're gonna be going tomorrow, though. Because I think this is gonna be a good place for me to... S oh, here we go. This is new. He got in trouble on the first day of school. Those guys are getting expelled. Nobody wants a troublemaker in school. Everyone's got high hopes for that new girl, Yoshizawa-chan. Damn, she's fine. I wonder if I have a shot with her. Okay. Final time to set the plan in motion. I bet the others are ready to go and waiting the signal. I'll leave the plan to you. If you can't execute the plan by the deadline, it's game over. Keep vigilant and be aware of the time remaining. Palaces contain strong enemies. Consult with your allies and make use of the various facilities in the, in the city to ensure a successful infiltration. When you have some free time and don't know what to do next, press the touchpad to open the assist command menu and you to see what you can do and who you can see. If network functions are on, this will enable you to see what other players did on this day in the calendar. The activity log is a support tool you can that can assist you during your free time. If you would like to know more about it, check the corresponding tutorial. Ooh. I'll just add this. I am going to like this, but this is a good place for me to pause right now. I'm going to be back up here in a couple minutes. Don't worry. I got time on my hands, so just save there. And I'll see you in a bit. <laughs> 